sound the alarm. It's high time. I kill what I kill what I kill. God kills and I make a lot. And God can save your life. Read on. I wound and I heal. If you get sick, it's because God allowed it to happen. If you get healed, it's because God allowed it. Read on. Neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. Because God controls our destiny. If you follow God and you do what he says, young man, nothing will happen to you. Yes. Yes. Right. Okay, I'm going to explain to you. You mind if we answer this young man's question? Go to Matthew chapter 24, verse 1. Yes, sir. The book of Matthew chapter 24 and verse 1. And Jesus went out and departed from the temple. Jesus, in the Bible, was the savior of the Israelites, of the 12 tribes of Israel. God sent him down to the earth to teach us how to live. So he was inspecting the churches at that time and the churches were no good. So he was leaving the church because he was fed up with the religious leaders. They were lying to the people. It says what? Read it again. And Jesus went out and departed from the temple. And his disciples came to him for to show him the building of the temple. The disciples were pulling him back. They were like, no, 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 don't leave. Look at how beautiful the temple is built. Read on. And Jesus said unto them, see ye not all these things? He said, you don't see what's going on around here? Read on. Verily I say unto you, there shall not be left here one stone upon another that shall not be thrown down. He said the churches are going to be destroyed because the churches were teaching the wrong thing back then, young man, just like the churches are teaching us the wrong thing now. Read on. And as he sat upon the Mount of Olives. So he left the church to go sit on the Mount of Olives and discuss prophecy and what God wants for the people. Read on. The disciples came unto him privately. How did they come? Privately. How did they come? Privately. Like you just did. You came privately. You said, why do we have COVID here? The disciples came to him privately saying, what's going on with this destruction? I thought God loves us. Read on. Saying, tell us, when shall these things be? When is this destruction coming up that you're speaking about, Christ? Read on. And what shall be the sign of thy coming? What are signs that you're coming back, Christ? Read on. And the end of the world. And the what? And the end of the world. COVID is here because this world is coming to an end. COVID is here because the men that rule the earth are evil. And it was created and put on the people, and now they're trying to inject poison into you. And the media is lying to you. That's why they keep telling you minorities are scared to take the medication because the people that were ruling the earth, they've always done bad things to us. So there's too much. That's why if you look on YouTube, you look on Facebook, they don't want nobody talking about where this came from. They're trying to stop. Anybody post something on their page, if it's not, if it's a lie, prove that it's a lie. Why are they restricting the content? They don't want people to say, look, we know where the COVID came from. That's why the president said it's the Chinese disease. He said Chinese people made it up. The Chinese people said, no, we didn't. This was sent to us in a lie. We got it in 2015. The, the, the Fauci was the one that paid money for it to go there and engineer it. So that it's, COVID's been around for a long time. I heard, bro, but it took his aunt, and it took him, I mean, it hurt him bad. He don't know what COVID is. It took his aunt, my sister. It took my only sister. Well, brother, don't let it get him. No. And don't let it no. get you. He just got tested. He's negative. All praises. Yes, sir. Okay? Yes. We're out here so that it doesn't get you. Right. We're out here so that if it does get into your system, it won't take your life. Because right. give me Deuteronomy 32, verse 39. Watch this, watch this, watch this. This is what the people don't know. Deuteronomy 32, verse 39. Watch this. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 32 and verse 39. See now that I, even I, am he. He, God is establishing himself that I am God. Read on. And there is no God with me. He don't answer to nobody. Nobody works with him. Read on. I kill. What? I kill. What? I kill. God kills. And I make a lie. And God can save your life. Read on. I wound. And I heal. If you get sick, it's because God allowed it to happen. If you get healed, it's because God allowed it. Read on. Neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. Because God controls our destiny. If you follow God and you do what he says, young man, nothing will happen to you. Okay, I, I used to not follow God also. I used to follow what the world says. I used to do whatever I want. But when I read the Bible, from the men that taught me the Bible, it changed my life. Okay, but watch this. Reverse.
Proverbs 16, verse 24. Yes, sir. The book of Matthew, chapter 16 and verse 24. Then said Jesus unto his disciples, If any man will come after me... What we're doing out here with this Bible is bringing you to the Lord because they lied to us about the Lord. This is what the Lord looks like according to the Bible. But they tell you he's a white man with blonde hair and blue eyes. Which is this. Okay? Is they give you that image. That's a lie. This is what Christ looks like according to the Bible. Did you know that, young man? This is what he looks like. He's black like you. He's black like your uncle. Your, your, your grandfather. He's black like your grandfather. If Christ was here, look at your grandfather's face and look at him. They look exactly the same. But why did they tell us he was white? Because they hate us. When they enslaved us, they renamed us and changed the true image of Christ from the, from this to that. Read it again. If any man will come after me, let him deny himself. So we got to deny what we want. We got to stop being attached to this world and we got to deny what we want. Read on. And take up his cross. And, and take up our problems. Take up the depths that's around us. The drug addiction. The alcoholism. Your crosses is what you carry that's bothering you in life. Your adultery, your sinning, your stealing, your lying. We got to deny our body that wants to do those things. Read it again. And take up his cross and follow me. And now we got to follow what the Bible says. Yes, sir. Go ahead. So, so should we get the back? Should we get the back? Me, I'm, one, I'm not a... going like God. Your question, should we get the vaccination? Me, I'm 100%, I'm 100 percent against it. But guess what? They're forcing us to do it. They're forcing us. They're making it so we can't eat. They're making it so that we can't. So I can't tell somebody you're sitting if you so do. Because I'm raising my grandson. I did it. I got both my vaccinations. Well, look, the only thing for you now is for you to return to the Father so he can protect you. I already showed you what he says. Yes, I kill, I make alive, I wound, and I heal. He can make it so that if they did do something to try and harm you, you don't die. God has protected the Israelites here. They tried to wipe us out numerous times. They always try to wipe us out. I got it because I was afraid. I don't want to die right now. Nobody, yes, want, nobody want to die. die. But we want to eat. Well, everybody we want to go to yes. Okay? Okay, <laughs> say that again. Everyone want to go to heaven and no one want to die. That's a true saying. That's a true saying. You got it? Yes, sir. The book of Matthew, chapter 19 and verse 28. Jesus said unto them, Verily I say unto you, that that ye have, so my body, verily I say unto you, that ye which have followed me. So, we have to follow Christ. That's what we're out here to teach you how to follow Christ. Read the verse up before that. Watch this. Verse 27. Then answered Peter. Peter was one of the disciples of Christ. Then answered Peter and said, watch this. And said unto him, Behold, we have forsaken all. And follow thee. I changed my whole life around to follow what you're saying, Christ. I'm afraid I'm raising three Watch this, brother. Children. I want to be around for them to graduate, go to high school, college. I did it. Brother. You said you want to see them graduate college. I do. Okay, so watch this. Follow these instructions yes, real quick. Yes. No. Brother, let me show them something real quick. Let me show them something real quick. Let me show him something real quick. Watch this. What shall we have there for? So he said, I changed my whole life to follow you. What am I going to get from following you? Because that's what I ask. I ask, why should I follow this man? How is it going to benefit me? Read on. And Jesus said unto them, Verily I say unto you, that ye which have followed me in the regeneration. How do we follow Christ? By his word. His word. He left instructions for us to follow. He died and his spirit was going to be regenerated on the earth. So he said, ye which have followed me in the regeneration, read on. When the Son of Man shall sit in the throne of his glory. That's why we speak about the kingdom of earth on heaven. It's in the Lord's prayer. Our Father which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. A new kingdom is going to be on this earth. The United States of America will be destroyed by fire. That's what, that's what Babylon is. America is a dump land. That's right. <laughs> America is a wasteland. He called it a dump land. It's a wasteland. wasteland. Okay, if you're not paying attention to right now, the government is falling. They're giving away money. They don't, businesses are closing. Their education don't mean nothing. America's falling apart. Okay, the leaders don't care. Everybody in government now is for money. Read it again. Verily I say unto you, 
that ye which have followed me in the regeneration. Why? Because these men died. The Bible says that God regenerates spirits. He's going to send them back to the earth. That's what he was telling Peter. Because Peter was dead and gone. But his spirit will be regenerated and sent back. Ye which have followed me in the regeneration. Read on. When the Son of Man shall sit in the throne of his glory. Because his kingdom is going to be established on this earth. Christ is King of kings and Lord of lords. Every knee shall bow. Every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess when he comes back. Yes. Read on. He also shall sit upon twelve thrones, judging the twelve tribes of Israel. Brother, you a king. Your grandson is a king. He's a prince. Okay? He's a prince also. When he grows up, he's going to be a, a king. mighty king. Yes. Okay? We just don't know that because the world has yeah, reduced us to nothing. The world out. reduced us to nothing. Read on. And everyone that hath forsaken houses, or brethren, or sisters. Some people have lost their house, their brother, their sister. You said you lost your sister. Everyone that has lost those things, read on. Or father, or mother. Our mom, mother, and father's dead. Okay, they all died sick and in pain. They left this earth horribly. Read on. Or wife, or children. Some of us have lost our wives, our children. Read on. Or lands. Some of us have to leave lands. Read on. For my name's sake. But with believing what Christ says. Read on. Shall receive an hundredfold. You're going to get back a hundred times what you lost. Okay. You are made to come on this earth. Get old and die and lose everything. And struggle and have a rough life. Okay. Everyone that has forsaken. And everyone that hath for houses. Or brother. Or sisters. Or father. Or mother. Or wife. Or children. Lands. For my name's sake, shall receive a hundredfold. You're going to get back a hundred times better. The world ain't telling you that. The church ain't telling you that. Read on. And shall inherit everlasting life. You know what it means to live forever? There will be no more sickness. When God's, the reason why the sickness and disease is because men rule this earth. The diseases and the sicknesses are man-made. That's why they're banning people on Facebook talking about it. They're banning people on YouTube talking about it. Because it's man made. That's why the president said it's the Chinese disease. It came from a land, uh, a lab in Wuhan, China. And they took uh, animal DNA. We used to scream black power while heroin was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission Minor murmuring, omitting and missing the mark Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark We on Paul's mission We out on the road Purple and gold From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana Sierra Leone 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling These are how our men repented at heart the scriptures is proof, IUIC, we deliver the truth.